I really have such fond associations. You know, some of the most profound experiences of my life have been in the depths of what I call the Kundalini K-hole. Uh, I hope that catches on. One well, little bit of, uh, like, a pro tip that I'd like to give to all the indigo warriors out there is if, uh, you don't have a Surface, uh, you can use your iPhone. <sighs> you want to make sure that your iPhone is turned off when doing bumps off of it because if you get a text message and then the screen will glow and you won't get the satisfying experience of being able to watch the drugs go into your body. That's my favorite. It's reminiscent of when I was a teenager, I would just watch myself smoking cigarettes in the mirror. Just something so satisfying about it. But I'm just gonna do a little bump ski right now. Just a little bump, just a little, just, just a little goose bump. Doing some goose bumps. Ooh, 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 ooh. Are you afraid of the hole? This Special lady is not. So, uh, yeah, if you, uh, stop filming, I'm gonna just do this real quick. And then, like, if the feds ask, I was just, this is just baking soda, and this is just a prop, and, uh, this is just a comedy skit about... Society yeah. is totally a fuck-to-death carnival right now, and all the best medicines are illegal and uh, all the most corrosive toxic poisons are just readily available for all the boys and girls and cats and squirrels so you know like I uh, just if you could just you could cut Ooh. tone with me tone with me right now Ooh. so uh, my name is Rachel Lambert and I just got back from Burning Man and I know that it's December, and that happened in August, but uh, I just got back. And I just want to share with you some of the psycho-spiritual technologies that I've recently stumbled upon that has, like, uh... I feel closer to Christ consciousness than I've ever been in my life. Really, really propelling me to really, like, applicable, pragmatic levels of like shifting the fucking situation stop and I just it's so it, you know, those who are in the know know that it's really hard to articulate these things but like the downloads the extractions that I've been having recently of just like this fucking world saving information has just been fucking god 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 it's coming at me way faster than I can articulate but I'm gonna give it a good shot so so anyway, I was I, I went I went to, I, I was I, I was I was at Burning Man and I met, and I met, and I met, met this guy and we we went back to Israel and he is so influential that he's like major big time influencer guy fucking and fucks like a reindeer and uh, and that's a plus yeah I pretty much just stayed in his apartment and just like had realizations and stuff and just really like found out who I was. Because the world is, the world is chaos, right? And then you can go within and you can see what am I juxtaposed to, to the world. And then once you, once you carve out the ice sculpture of, of the, the demi-Christ that you wish to embody in the, in this circus, then you can go back out there and it's like the, just the, 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 the tides part and you're just like fucking, so... Like that, he wasn't really like the most honest or um, ethical or I don't, you know what, I don't really even know who that was or what those three months of my life were really all about. But afterwards, I, I so I ended up in LA and with this other guy that I that I met on the playa and really I, like at the burn I was I was pretty rejectful towards him but. He totally forgave me, and, you know, I really, really, like, I feel like, you know, it's one step to get to the next. And, like, my, my stay in Jerusalem was, was necessary for my time with Chris. And, and, and he showed me, he showed, what I'm, like, I'm just gonna live it out. 
I don't need to... There's some things that aren't words. Alan Watts said a lot that really, really resonates deep, hard within, within... So that I end up in L.A. in his apartment, and he has the prescription to pure liquid ketamine, right? And so, um... So, I, I left rather abruptly, um, in the middle of the night, and I got, I, 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 I have a mason jar full of liquid consciousness. The, thing, the important thing is that it's not the drugs that align or awoken or enlighten you. It's just you plus. <sighs> I, I tried to go back to my, I guess you could say my old job. Uh, the other day, and they were super rude to me, and there was this, this security guard. I told them very, very clearly, I do, I do three festivals a year, and in order to remain aligned, look, I'm a tourist, okay, I'm all over the place, but I'll come, and when I'm charging at you, and I got you in my deadlights, that's, these are special times. If you want empathic, enlightened employees, like me, then you know France is on fire right now, and that I America is watching. Look, every now and then you need you need some self a self care, a, a, a little a three months to find out who you are and how you help here, and that's what. So I did. a bit of psycho spiritual technology that I want to share with all of the consciousnesses in the universe right now is that of what I call the Keddie Pot. Um, and I know, I know, I know that, I know, I know that there is, uh, there is a mentionable degree of pliverage in my having infinite access to medical grade liquid ketamine. And not all of the people in the world have such a silver spoon. I think that Earth gave forth this particular compound to help to chemically assist us in achieving what we need so direly right now, which is to realize that we're all just one. We're all one thing. And, and, and there's lots of books and scriptures and gurus saying all the woke shit, but like you got. I think you need to approach this at a neurochemical level. Thinking you're egoless is not the same thing. Alan Watts said, "Reality is not words. It's well." What I'm saying to you is that. Christ consciousness is not thinking you have Christ consciousness. The kundalini k-hole is not words. It's... Shit out, bro. Which I could stop at any time, but you know. I was such a good girl in my in my teens and early twenties that I'm gonna indulge a bit, you know? You gotta trust yourself. <sighs>